Hi, I'm Macy from the Charleston County Public Library, and thanks for watching this virtual program. September is Library Card Sign-Up Month, and your Charleston County Library Card is the key to a wealth of information and resources for free. Of course we have tons of books. We also have movies, telescopes, museum passes, and gaming tablets for kids. And your library card gives you access to tons of digital content, like ebooks, audiobooks, music, and magazine subscriptions, plus access to databases for professional development, learning a new language, and genealogy research. Your library card is available for free if you live in Charleston County. Just stop by your neighborhood branch with your proof of address and your ID. For more information, visit ccpl.org. Hi everyone, I'm Devin Andrews. I'm the Community Engagement Manager for Charleston County Public Library. And this is... Elliot. Elliot. <laughs> and today, we're going to be making a tasty sweet treat, uh, s'mores cookie cups. So, what ingredients do we need in s'mores, Elliot? Uh, all these ingredients. All these ingredients. You got it right here. So, first... I want to... <laughs> you gotta make sure they're good before we use them in our recipe. I make sure they're good. Okay. Hello, Mom. We need seven graham crackers. I will have only one graham cracker now. Okay, this will be yours to try. Mmm. <laughs> Is it good? Mm -hmm. Okay. While you're sampling that, I'm going to take seven graham crackers and put them in a bag to crush up. We've got three, six, and seven. seven. And we have one graham cracker left. I know. I wonder who will eat that. You know a kid that likes graham crackers? Who? <laughs> Is it you? Yeah. Yeah? Okay, so we've got them in a bag, and we've got our rolling pins. So we can crush all the graham crackers up. See, graham cracker crumbs. You want me to push on the pin? Roll it. There you go. Good work. Get them all crumbled. And of course, you can buy pre crushed graham cracker crumbs if you want to. But we're going to crush ours ourselves. Mom, don't graham cracker that. Dad said you're crushing them so much and they're sad. They're sad? Oh no. But aren't they happy to be part of our recipe? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, do they look good and crushed up to you? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Let's see. All right. Okay. They look pretty good to me too. So we're gonna take them and put them in our bowl. And pour them in our bowl. And then we're going to put six. I'm just going to add two. Okay. <laughs> we're going to put six tablespoons of melted butter in there, which I've got right here. We're going to pour that in there. Mmm. And one fourth of a cup of powdered sugar. I want to do it. Okay, you pour that in there. Good job. And then we're gonna stir it all together. Don't have the well mixer. No, we're not using a mixer for this recipe. We don't need one. So this is gonna help the graham cracker crumbs stick together and be a good crust for our s'mores cookie cups. Mm -hmm. Wait, where's the s'mores cookie cups? <laughs> we're making them. Oh. Okay, so now, we have some mini muffin tins that we're going to use. And can you help me and put a, a small spoonful of the graham cracker crumbs in each little cup? And I am going to grab our cooking spray. We'll do that. Spray. Is that bug that spray? What, sweetie? Bug spray. <laughs> no, it's not bug spray. Gross! Bug spray in our food. 
That's funny. It's non-stick cooking spray, so I'll just please not get stuck in the pan. You're doing a really good job. That's a perfect amount. Well, now I'm done. Um, yep, yeah, just about. Okay. So then, you want to do this one for me? I'm going to just press these into the, press them together so that they'll stay together at the bottom of our muffin cups and be a good crust for our cookies. This is going to be so tasty. I'm going to get a little bit more. Sprinkle them in there. Oops, sorry. I failed it. That's okay. We'll clean up. Mmm, you think this is going to taste good? I don't know. <laughs> Done. Good job. more than like a crumb or two in there. You want to put a little bit more in there? Mom, we're losing clam cracker pieces. Oh no, it's okay. We're gonna have enough for our recipe. Mom did it. Good work. Look. Okay, now I think these are done these and just press them into the cups. Thank you for your help. I put it. Can I buy TV now? <laughs> no. Because we're still making a recipe together. Oh. We've only just started. Have more very important jobs for you. Mm. How's your graham cracker? Mm. Oh, good. Oh. All good. Bye, oh, good work. Okay. I think we have a good amount here. I'm just eating the crumbs. Oh, okay. That's all right. Okay. So now I'm going to wash my hands, but we're also going to just stick these um, graham cracker crusts into well, the oven. I don't oven. want to wash my hands. You don't have to. You didn't get them um, all oily like mine are, or buttery. We're going to stick them in the oven for uh, four minutes at 350 degrees. And then we will do our next step. We're going to go ahead and get the marshmallows ready. So we need 12 marshmallows. Can you hand me 12 marshmallows, please? Here, I got four. These ones are stuck together. Can you pull them apart? Thank you, Here. so that's one. I'm just gonna cut them all in half. And then I got two, two. Thank you. <laughs> Are those good? I would just eat one tiny part of the marshmallow. Okay. Three. I got another marshmallow that you needed. Thank you. But I, I can try one of the marshmallows. I would try this marshmallow. <laughs> hey, I don't know if you're helping me as much as just eating everything. Four, five, thank you, six, thank you, seven, eight, 
eight, nine, How many is that? Ten. Ten, yeah. So we need two more, please. Two more, thank you. Okay, one, well, we're stuck together. Yep. Yeah. Eleven, twelve. So now we have twenty-four pieces of marshmallows because we cut them all in half. Let me move this over here, and now, so all we ever do is go, yeah, yeah, yeah. So all we ever do is go, yeah, yeah, yeah. And we don't even care about what they did. Yeah, 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 yeah. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> it's a good song. Mm -hmm. Now we need two Hershey bars, but you can use Reese's cups or Hershey Kisses if you want. And we're just going to break them all. Mom, can I have one? Pieces. I want. You can, yes, in just a second. So that's going to give us two Hershey bars, will give us 24 pieces too. So we'll have 24 marshmallow halves and 24 chocolate say, pieces. Say, say one, one of those for me. Wait a second, do you like candy? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Are you sure? I like it. Oh. Candy so candy. <laughs> candy so candly. Um, how do you ask for things? Please. But then, what if we don't have enough for our recipe? Yes, we do. Okay, thankfully, I bought enough chocolate that you can have some too while we make our recipe. Ooh, yum. It's really tasty, isn't it? Oh, that's our timer. That means that the graham cracker crust is done. So I'm gonna grab those out of the oven and we'll do our next step. Now I'm gonna put those pans on these, but it's a very important, don't touch the pans, okay? Because they're gonna be hot. Okay, so your very important job is to hand these marshmallow halves to me for me to stick on top of the crust. Yep, Thank here. you. And here. So each of the cups will get one marshmallow on top. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Yummy. Mom, take these two. Or these two. These two. Take these two. Thank you. More, please. Here. These one to come together. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, keep handing them to me because now we'll do this one. Thank you. Oh, these are going to taste so good. Now, what I'm going to do next after these are all on here is I'm going to broil them for about one to two minutes. Here. Thank you. And I'm gonna keep an eye on it because we know marshmallows can catch on fire pretty easily in the oven when you're broiling them. So it'll probably be closer to one minute than it is to two, but I'll be watching them so they don't get too burnt, but just toasty enough. Daddy, mom, these ones are stuck. Thank you. Okay, so I'm gonna pop these in the broiler, under the broiler in the oven, and I'm gonna grab some more chocolate because <laughs> Some got eaten in the process. So I'm going to stick one of these on top of each toasty, toasty marshmallow. So will you just keep handing me chocolate? Chocolate. Thank you. Chocolate. You're the best assistant in the whole world. Do you know that? Mm -hmm. Um, I gave you one. I gave you these one. Thank you. You, so I'm just lightly pressing it in there, not touching the marshmallow so I don't hurt my hands. On here. I'm just letting it press in there and get got gooey two, and melty. I got two one for you to do. Thank you. 
Yummy. I love these chocolate bars. <laughs> Me too. But I have a one at the morning. No, don't throw any. We don't want the puppies to eat them because, you know, chocolate's very bad for dogs, right? Mom, I made a E-L-I-O tea. I made a tea. A tea? You did. Huh? Is there a tea in your name? Uh, yeah. <laughs> did you just lick that one? Mm -hmm. I think some of the chocolates, you keep, you keep that one for yourself. I think some of this chocolate's been disappearing. Yay. All the chocolate. Yep. Yeah. A little bit more. Because some hungry kids been eating Mommy, some. Mommy, here. Yummy. No, you eat that one. Okay, so these look really tasty. So all we're going to do now is I mean, let them cool yeah. off. I mean, um, I mean your chocolate bar. Okay. You don't need to eat it. I told you to eat it. Uh, we're going to let them cool for about 10 to 15 minutes until they're not super hot. And then we'll use a butter knife to help pop them out of the tins. And then we'll eat them up. That's it. So it's easy, tasty treat. Uh, you can store them in an airtight container for a few days in case you can't eat them all at once. And you can even zap them in the microwave for a couple of seconds if you eat them a day or so later to get them all melty and warm again. Like my hands. So thanks for hanging out with us. Try this at home. And we'll be back again to show you some more recipes. See you later. Bye. Say bye. Bye. <laughs>